I going to be in your way if I get back down on those cars? Alright guys, um, I'm back. Wow. So, thank you to Unicorn Riot, they have looked at a hack, so I should be able to stay live as long as I'm not hacked. Some very strange things are happening to my phone and also to their phone. So, apparently the story that's going out is these water cannons are being used to put out fires. These water cannons are not being used to put out fires. These water cannons are being used on peaceful, unarmed protectors. If you can, when you're joining, if you can add a heart emo emoticon that helps this be seen by more people. Thank you for coming back. What you're watching is the blockade on 80, Highway 1806. This is this is the this is a public road. You're going to see those law enforcement vehicles up the hill there. You're going to see there's a fire on the side here, which is going to be reported about being a fire. But what you're going to see is, and it's very hard to stream in here, go in here close. But this is a fire to keep people warm because it is about, mm, it's probably about 10 degrees right now. If you want to help stop this, you can write to the army or you can call the army corps. You can call the White House. from all the banks that are connected to Dakota Access Pipeline through the energy transfer partners which is the, the, the financial side of this because money money talks you can help by doing that so the mainstream media apparently have been sharing that this is uh, to put out fires water cannons are being being used what I will say is since since uh, since we put out that about the water cannons and showed that and so many people shared that and thanks for sharing it the majority of the time on the bridge right now the water cannons have not been being used they stopped they suddenly changed their tactics completely so they are still using them against the peaceful water protectors around bonfires on the left hand side here they have a mobile water cannon but the main water cannon that they were using appears to have stopped being used and as far as I can see the silk water protectors stood on the very bridge so there's nothing changed on this side the only thing that's changed is on the other side so the story getting out there and you guys sharing it you are protecting people here by sharing this so if you're coming please share this thank you for being with us for five hours in Melbourne Australia that's amazing I know the world is watching because the, the, the mainstream media, not only they don't share this, but what they do is they twist whatever's said about this to, to, try and, to try and make it look like that this poor Morton County Sheriff are under attack and there's fires everywhere and that's why the water cannon's here. I'm here to tell you, I'm stood on this hill looking at this live. The water cannon has been being used on peaceful unarmed water protectors. If you go to Digital Smoke Signals, you will find them on Facebook, Digital Smoke Signals. They have live stream. They also have drone footage of close up showing what was happening. When I left to go and charge my phone in a vehicle, the woman who was there told me her daughter had been on the front line and watched the guy next to her being shot. I also spoke to someone else who saw someone next to them be shot and had their, in, in the head and split their head open. I've heard reports of 167 water protectors needing medical attention. I've heard reports of three elders being harmed. I've got an unf unconfirmed report of one of them going into cardiac arrest after being harmed by the militarized police. That is the LRAD being used. Correct? Yep. They are now using the LRAD, which is the noise cannon. What that does, if anyone doesn't know, is designed to, one, it deafens you if you're close enough, but two, it also completely disorientates you. So they have people right now in freezing conditions, wet, fired with tear gas, wet with a water cannon, and they're now releasing the LRAD, which is going to make these people so they are confused as to which direction they're walking and where they're going. Remind you again, these are unarmed, peaceful water protectors. So if you share, please share this. 
Yes, anyone that is unable to come here and support physically, what we ask you to do is to call the White House, to call Army Corps of Engineers, to call your governor, to take your money out of the banks that are supporting the Dakota Access Pipeline through energy transfer partners. You will find all this information on Facebook because money talks. If you move your money, they will start to listen. But right now, this is militarized police against unarmed, peaceful water protectors. I've had reports of peop that people being shot from the military. You see, the water cannon is being used again. You just saw that right there. Please use the hearts only on this feed. Hearts only. But you will see that water cannon was just used again down there. I don't know if the Bismarck media are down here or not, or down there, but I do know that... Is it charged? Yeah. Fully? Yep. Cool. Cool, yeah. This just died for no apparent reason. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you can switch me. That's fine. This is yours. Oh, that's your cord, right? Yeah, that's my cord. Mm -hmm. I'm on to Let me straight in. Make sure it's switched on. Okay. Uh, back in. Sorry for us for a second. That was you. I'm right. All of a sudden, their media is going out. Their battery. Packs going down. I love you too, Maya. Thank you. Thank you for what you do. Thank you for the big protectors rally in Minnesota. Keep doing those things. Keep going to the banks. Keep going to the places. In Minnesota, you managed to pull back Hennepin County because the people spoke and they realized they didn't want their police here supporting this. Right now, you'll see the water cannon is being used again down there. The lies that are going out on mainstream media about there being fires, you can see there is one fire being used to warm people. There's a fire below me on the hill here. I'm sorry, my, my phone does some really strange stuff right now. So are you guys telling me it's not focused? I can see that. Unfortunately, for whatever reason, it doesn't like to focus. This is a brand new Samsung Edge 7. So there should be no reason it's doing this. There should be no reason that my live feeds suddenly go. So you can ask yourself the question why you think that's happening. Thank you for everyone who's watching this and sharing this. Thank you for Australia for being there. There was a girl that was hit in the back by a rubber bullet. Oh, ABC and NBC said people were rioting and they've retracted that. And they said that I gotta read that, that's brilliant. They were saying the protesters were rioting and now they've retracted their story or changed it to clashing or a standoff. There has been no rioting here. There is no rioting, there's peaceful water protectors. There's that water cannon being used again. If you see down there, that is the water cannon being used right now. That water cannon they're telling you used against fire, that was just being used at well below zero temperatures and peaceful water protectors so don't believe the garbage they're putting out on the main press if I sound a touch angry right now I'm very I'm upset yeah you're right I'm upset because this is this is ridiculous this is tax dollars please keep the emotion cons as hearts because that helps this feed stay live send prayer protection for the brave water protectors that are down there being doused in below zero temperatures with a water cannon if you don't like what you're seeing share it if you don't like the fact that the police and your your tax dollars are being used for this you're watching it 